Hello everyone, it's Seaput Magur again here. If you are sharing your Windows PC with your family members, or setting up a PC to be shared by several employees in your office, it is strongly recommended that you create a local or offline account for each of your family member or employee. By having a separate account, each user can keep his or her files, browsing history and user profile information private. And most importantly, you as the administrator can control the level of access each user has on your PC so that you can prevent them from deleting any system files or running any malware-infected programs. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a local offline account on Windows 10. Alright, let's get started. First, click the Start Menu button and then click Settings. On the Settings window, scroll down and then click Account. On the Accounts window, click Family and Other Users. Then on the Family and Other Users page on the right, click Add Someone Else to this PC. On the Microsoft Account Sign-In dialog, click I don't have this person's sign-in information. And then on the Microsoft Account Creation dialog, click Add a new user without a Microsoft account. On the Username and Password dialog, enter the desired username and password for this offline account. For user verification during password recovery, select three password recovery questions and provide the answers accordingly. Once you are done, click Next, and the new local account will be created. By default, the type of the new local account you just created is Standard User. If you want to change this account's type, click the account and then click Change Account Type. On the Change Account Type dialog, you can choose between Administrator and Standard User and then click OK. For this example, I will just leave the account type standard user as I do not want to give full access, such as installing a program, to this account. Now the new account's owner can start using this account to log in to your PC. To log in with this new account, click the Start Menu button, and then click the current user, and then click the new account's name. Windows will then log the current user out and show the login screen to prompt the new user to enter his or her password. Enter the password and then press enter on the keyboard. Upon successful first-time login, Windows will set up the profile and data folders of the new user. Once the new user has logged on, she can customize her local account, such as changing her profile picture and desktop background, without affecting other users on this PC. And if you open the file explorer, you will notice that you will have a separate folders for your documents, pictures, videos, and etc. Your browser settings and browsing history will also be kept private and inaccessible by other users on this PC. Finally, if you want to log out from this PC, simply click the Start Menu button, and then click Current User, and then click Sign Out. On the login screen, you will see the list of local accounts on this PC at the bottom left corner of the screen. If any one of the users wants to log into this PC, he or she can just click his or her username on that list and then enter the password. Alright, so that's how simple it is to create an offline or local account in Windows 10. So thank you for watching and see ya in the next tutorial.